Ah, so you're finally awake. I see. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, welcome to Little Nightmares. You know, I said I'd be playing it, so now I'm playing it. Let's go. Now, I've already played this game, obviously. I've said that multiple times now. It's like my well, it's in my top 10 at least so i i just had to play it especially after playing inside and limbo it's a great game to come to now i like i said before and i'll say it again i absolutely love this game just the atmosphere the enemies just everything about it i love it especially these little things you can just pick them up and you just absolutely launch them so satisfying. I forget about this room, you know. It's just... I forget that someone, y you know. But we're just gonna ignore that fact and just move on. No! I love these guys. Come here. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Yay! Love these little guys. And then... we Into the sludge. Now, I'm probably gonna fail this quite a few times because this is actually genuinely hard to do. Or not. Yeah. Never mind, I've just learned how to do that part from last time I played it. I swear, the first time that I played this game, I was stuck in that part for like, at least three or four deaths. I just couldn't understand how to get past the last one. Now I- ah, uh, just like, the amount of detail that goes into this game. Like, it's revealed right at the end that, oh yeah, then you- here we go, the janitor. That, oh my god, these characters are so cool and creepy. Anyways, back to what I was saying. I love how this game doesn't show that you're on a ship till like, the end of the game. But it's so obvious the entire time from how the uh, screen moves. Now we have an eye. If you if it looks at you, uh, it just turns you to stone. It's like Medusa in a way. But we just run past it, make sure they hide behind all the buddy things in a way, and can't go wrong. Light it. Thank you. I'm not going to worry about too much about exploring in this, uh, just this playthrough. Because I've basically done all of that. Oh yeah, shit, this part. Hell yeah. Oh, it's so fucking cool. Just the long arms are so intimidating. And the fact that he's also blind and can't see just really puts the cherry on top for this character. Like... Oh, I love all the characters in this game. Oh yeah, we've got hunger scenes as well. Anyways, thanks for the meat. Mmm, scrumptious. Get in my tummy. Thank you, kind sir. I definitely won't be eating a human later. Now, I don't, I, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be playing for the DLC for this game. It, I might. You never know. Wait. You're required to do this every time you play this game. <laughs> Just to give you an idea of how deep the buddy drop is if you fall. Push it! Yeah! Now we have a noose. Just look at the amount of kids that messed up. No! And I'm one of those kids. Damn, I suck at this game. Go along with it. Go along with it. Six! That was a bit more close than I would have liked. But we good. Make the mad dash. Oh, and make the jump. Push it off. Oh, no. Wait, don't, don't push it off. I need, I need it to get up. It'll be pushed off by itself. My inner instinct for it just to fall off kicked in. What the fuck? Whose ass is this? Oh. 
Oh, fucking speedrun strats. Let's go. I'm a goddamn speedrunner. It's all starting to come back to me about what areas happened. Oh my god, again already? You just ate like five minutes ago. You just ate. Oh yeah, wait, you, you can light this quickly, yeah? You got time? Perfect. <laughs> Come on, let's find you some food. Let's find you some good old rat. I think this is a good time to mention that the soundtrack for this game is also amazing. Ah, oh, the rat's later in the game. Come here, meat. Gimme the meat. Nom 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 nom. Mmm, delicious, delicious. Mmm. I'm sorry. Mm. <laughs> no!